Hello, my name is Janusz Schnodj, Global Program Manager, Real-Time Support Channels from SAP, and I'm here with my colleague, Josef Smith. Hello, my name is Josef Schmidt, and I'm the Development Lead of Build-In Support. Thank you, Josef. So, this is our vision about the way to the intelligent enterprise, which is written as part of every ticket presentation. So let's move on to our content right now. In the next couple of minutes, I will speak about AI and real-time offerings from product support. You may heard the word about incident solution matching. The background of the incident solution matching is that if a customer has an issue and reporting to the SAP support or engineer ring and the issue get fixed, we SAP documenting it in our knowledge base document or a supportive corrective measure. Next time, when another customer has the same issue or solution matching, automatically propose the solution based on the data that the customer has entered. With this mechanism, we can reduce the solution time and we can bring you the solution in front of you during the submission process. If you know the machine learning algorithm, they get more clever when they are more used. The next channel is Ask an Expert Peer. Ask an Expert Peer let you collaborate your technical product-related questions with an expert outside SAP. You may ask the question, why I turn to an expert outside SAP? The reason is very simple, and the answer is very simple. They know the industry know-how, they have the industry expertise, and they can give you the answer faster sometimes than our support organization. We fully integrated this solution into our reporting workflows, so product defects are able to forward it with a single click to product support. Next channel is SAP community, SAP's professional network, which is, I have to say, but one of the fastest channels. It's ideal for find answers, for basic questions, for SAP product business users or developers. The last two channels are staffed by SAP product support experts. The first, what I would like to talk about is the expert chat, which is a live chat function, which connects you with the SAP support expert. This is available 24 by five for general solutions and available for business hours in highly specialized country running functions. It also supports six additional languages using SAP's machine translation. Most of the cases which are reported by in expert chat are getting solved, but if for the unresolved issues, the experts are converting these two incidents. And the last channel, is an appointment-based scheduling service, the Schedule an Expert, which is, enables you to have a 30 minutes call with a technical expert of the topic at the time, which is works for you. This is a unique support in the industry. And as you see, it was honored by several awards, which I put two most important here. For new cases, this requires two days, two business days lead time, to allow to engineers to prepare. Okay, these were the channels for new cases. And you may have the question how they are supporting the situation that don't open a support ticket. Because these channels, you, during using these channels, you may get your issue resolved and you don't need to submit a ticket to our product support. But let's see what happens if you had to open a ticket because you found the product may function and you need to communicate with those supporting outside of an incident. Then you can use schedule an expert for open incidents, which connects you with the incident processor. And during the 30 minutes call, which is delivered by Microsoft Teams application, you can clarify your workflow. You can discuss the next steps for the resolution. If your issue is getting business critical, you can use Schedule Manager for high priority incidents where you can contact with 
one of the support managers from the respective team where you can discuss the service exceptions. That's all. So you see, product support is trying to help you and trying to give you many opportunities over support tickets and trying to support you as much as you can. But before we turn into the next chapter of this presentation, let's have a little quiz. Did you know that product support has delivered 1 million expert chats in 2021? And did you know that two of the three cases, the solution was delivered for the customer's issue during 30 minutes? That's it, that's it, that's on the spot. Did you know that product support had run over 35,000 scheduling expert sessions? And did you know that incident solution matching, as I referred, automatically proposes the solutions based on the existing incidence data? You may know it, but if you are an SAP S4 HANA Cloud customer, or you are SAP Cloud ALM, or IBP customer, then did you know that you don't need to leave the product to get support using the built-in support? So let's see a quick video about built-in support and the possibilities. A modern integrated support experience to keep you focused on your business tasks this is Built-in Support, your easy access to product support and knowledge at SAP. Built-in Support provides an integrated platform that gives you a consistent support experience across all products. It embeds support directly into your application, providing access to support content, tools, and channels with no implementation effort required. Just click the support icon at the top of your screen for help. You can also view recommended links and track open issues. Built-in support uses natural language processing, AI, and machine learning technologies to provide relevant answers, personalized recommendations, and direct access to support experts. Intelligent Search knows where you are, so you don't have to explain your situation. Intelligent Matching accesses support content and your active incidents to find relevant solutions. And if you need more guidance, built-in support offers up alternative channels so you can get the answers you need. Creating an incident is easy. Simply click the Report an Issue button at the bottom right and type your concern. As you go, you can update incidents and attach additional documentation as needed. Everything is at your fingertips. And when you're done, just click Create Incident. Built-in support also offers a live support channel through the expert chat service. Now you can quickly collaborate with an SAP expert in real time, sharing knowledge and information to address your questions without leaving the application. Built-in support. It's an intelligent digital assistant that guides you through common support tasks. Start using it today. Built-in support is currently available with a limited number of products and will be available for more SAP solutions over time. For more information, visit SAP Support Portal. Thank you, Janus, for the presentation and welcome to the introduction of built-in support. So, in a little video, you have seen that built-in support provides a lot of features for you to contact SAP support. So what is built-in support? In a nutshell, built-in support is an AI-driven in-product support platform that provides you answers or connects you directly with SAP support. Built-in support is live with three, uh, with three products, that is S4HANA Cloud, Cloud ALM and IBP, and more products will come soon. The focus of built-in support was to focus on a simplified integration, so where we provided a low-code, no-code integration for products to achieve a fast onboarding and adoption along the SAP product pipeline. Of course, 
per product, we can extend the integration individually on a uh, project base. And we would like to reach out to customers and partners ITSM system to have a full cycle view on a uh, system uh, case when it is created. On the support feature set, we focused on real-time support as it has been shown by Janos, for example, expert chat. And the AI-based solution uh, services or cell services like solution matching and component prediction was also integrated. And on top of that, there is an intelligent search feature that provides you directly with content available from the SAP support knowledge base. On the user experience, we worked to try to find a way how to combine graphical and conversational UI to easily let you navigate through the support interaction. And to better consume the content we provide, you can easily resize the workspace we have. The highest topic on the UX was harmonized support experience across the entire product portfolio from SAP. That means no matter from which product you come and you would like to have SAP support, you always have the same user experience regarding support. And of course, we are built in support. So we, you can assume we are integrated and we are context aware so that we know where the user is and what the user tries to do. Before I go to the next slide, where I show you some introduction of the features. So, and of course, how to say solve an issue without creating an incident, I would like to recap a little bit because traditionally, when we as users of software, if we face an issue, we try to record an incident to get a solution for it. And that is what we would like to show how to do that without an incident. Yeah. And now let's assume, to give you a little bit of background, I'm a user in an S4HANA cloud system. I'm using the application My Timesheet Management where I face an issue. So after opening built-in support through this icon here, this a headset icon, I can start my support journey through various ways. And here in this case, I start with report a new issue. Once I click here, I will be forwarded to the report issue form where I can describe my situation. So first of all, I give it a title and then I add the more information on the situation I'm facing, the symptoms, etc. You all know this. And I can also add attachments if I like. So as soon as we see, let's say, a solution that could fit to this description you have provided, we light up this light bulb where you then consume the AI service we have integrated. You don't need to do anything else to start an AI uh, service. We do that directly for you. So how to consume this? You just click on this element and the list of solution proposals is provided to you. The solution provide, uh, provided are in the form of a KPA or an SAP node. You can open them and it will open directly in a different tab where you can browse through. And the current uh, application is not uh, attached so that you don't lose the context. So the, the better you describe your situation, the better the solution proposals will be. That means if you iterate over the description and of course also the subject, you automatically recheck and match the solutions with your updated context so that you can let's say, decide at what point in time do you find a solution to your situation. If you don't find a solution or you have an answer, a question to SAP support because something is not really, say, making, let's say, the, the full solution work, you can go to the next step. That is also built-in support. You will always find a way how to do the next step and how to, let's say, get in contact with SAP support. In that case, on the footer, you see the offered and recommended support channels. So based on the domain area, which is, by the way, also an AI service, which is connected to the built-in support, which is called a component predictor, it calculates automatically based on the component and the context you have, the component uh, you need. So that means it's easier for the customer to really 
that they get in contact with the right experts at SAP support. And based on the availability on the experts, we provide just the best and recommended support channel. The recommended support channel is always highlighted and comes in the first uh, position. In that case, we, we did a background check whether for this component, that means the domain, is an expert available to have a chat discussion with you to solve your issues. And just by clicking this button, all the context that is available in built-in support is handed over into the uh, back end of product support that an expert can browse through. And as you can see here, I'm in a position zero. That means I'm in next in line. And as soon as an expert picks this uh, request, the conversation can start. And in an ideal situation, the expert has already read through and knows what is the solution. Otherwise, a normal conversation starts. And if needed, an expert can also let's say, initiate a screen sharing session so that the customer and the SAP support engineer can have a, a closer look uh, together at the issue to find a solution. So as I said before, it would be nice to define a solution if you, let's say, with the AI self-services. If not, the best next option is expert chat, if available. So, and with that, I would like to also give you a little bit more information about the used AI services we have. So, AI-driven in-product support is seen as a quasi, let's say, industry standard in the future. And SAP already invested a lot in providing this kind of AI services for customers, such as an incident solution matching, that is what I've shown, the KBA and SAP node suggestion based on the context. The same context is used to find the right component, which was in the past uh, really, let's say, troublesome and not precise, let's say, work for the customer. That is where we would like to have the customers an easier transition. And for the users of uh, one support launchpad, the product function predictor will also help to simplify the interaction. In built-in support, we don't need that because we already know where we come from because of the context awareness. A similar uh, set of services, and of course a little bit more, is provided internally for SAP support expert, really to find the best answer and faster answers for your inquiry. And having said this, I would like to show you an integration and the architecture of built-in support. So the guiding principle for built-in support for this architecture was to be able to focus on our core services over the cluster management. We wanted to simply focus on the features so that we are able to faster roll out features for support for you as a customer. And we achieved this by deploying our services, which are written in Node.js uh, and Python, Java, and on the front end in TypeScript in UI5 React. We deployed it in a central Kubernetes cluster, which is also managed by SAP Gartner to achieve a provider independent deployment. So we easily can move into another provider without any uh, lock-in situation. The next standardization we achieved towards the user integration. So we focus on technologies for OpenID Connect and OAuth, which is fully supported natively by the strategic uh, user integration with the name SAP Universal ID. Any user using uh, built-in support can do so by authentication with SAP Universal ID. On a product integration point of view, we provided a standardized SDK so that the onboarding into a product is an easy and straightforward case and that we achieve with a low code, no code integration, a fast adoption along the entire SAP product uh, life cycle. On top of that, we would like to manage the, the cluster with our service mesh to really have a controlled way and a secure way to channel and connect external services into our system and to have a way 
to really have a service to service communication managed through Istio on top. That will also help us to do easily integrate in the monitoring infrastructure like Grafana and other tools. That's all coming out of the box. And that is what we try to focus to be agile and provide features in a fast way. What we do in a daily deployment to provide you really fast, let's say, value. Coming to this, I would like to recap on a demo what I showed and on the feature what has uh, been also shown by Janos, so the AI support services, the incident solution matching, for example, where we provide answers within an average 316 milliseconds. And that is, I would say, quite fast on the context given and the number maybe of uh, incidents available in the background that is a quite uh, stunning uh, number. And that gives also you as a user and a customer an edge over finding the right solution on the spot in a self-service manner. If you cannot find a solution in a self-service way, the best way to, to get in contact with SAP, of course, is through a real-time channel, because in a fast way, in 30 minutes or, or less, you may find an answer directly from an expert from SAP support. And the best of all of it, it's one click away in built-in support. And that is what I say, it's delighting customers always. So if you want to know more about real-time support or built-in support, just click on one of these links or scan the QR code to be navigated to the right spot where you can browse through and learn about our features and offerings. With having said this, I would like to say thank you for participating in this session. And I hope you found some new way how to interact with SAP and you try it out to solve issues without reporting an incident. Thank you.